Another topic that is talked about a lot in lesson one videos is this idea of full employment. An economy is at full employment when the economy is working at its capacity, basically meaning that its labor is being utilized at its fullest potential. Uh, another way to think about it is that the only unemployment present in the economy at a certain time is frictional and structural unemployment. To really understand the labor market, we want to see why people are unemployed. So we categorize them into three broad categories. The first one is structural unemployment. Structural unemployment means that someone is unemployed because their skills are no longer needed. A good example would be like if someone had the skill of uh, fixing beepers or fixing VCRs. Uh, their skill is no longer needed, so they need to figure out a way to update their skills to re-enter the labor force. This is what we call a good type of unemployment because we want to see people's skills being outdated and people updating their skills so that way we get better products and we advance as an economy. The second type of unemployment would be frictional unemployment. And frictional unemployment is when your skills are needed, you're just trying to find the job that's right for you. In economics, we call this friction. There's some job search friction when you're searching for your job. Uh, this is good as well for the economy because we don't want people to just take the first job that's available to them. For example, when you go ahead and graduate with your economics degree, we don't want you to walk out in the street, look across and see that there's a job open for an accountant and take that job because you aren't going to be the best person for that job. We want there to be some time that people search for the best job that's available for them. On the other side of the coin, we want firms to be hiring not the first person who comes in the door, but taking some time to find the person who's best fit for the job. The third type of unemployment, which is our bad type of unemployment, is cyclical unemployment. That's when your skills are needed, so you are an engineer, there just aren't any jobs anywhere for you. And that's due to a recession. It's due to businesses and firms losing profits. So when we talk about the economy being at full employment, we're talking about only structural and frictional unemployment being present.